so first of all thank you to jack sister for helping me record all these videos live from our ot so we are going to move over from skin grafting handles to dermatomes the first one was a paget brown dermatome which used to have a rolling drum and it was a uh, quite a tedious process then we shifted over to pneumatic uh, dermatomes this is connected with a pneumatic outlet and it used to require a lot of assembly the blade goes here you need to put this back on top you have a screw driver for fixing it so it used to take a lot of time so now we have shifted over to state of the art battery powered dermatomes you can have those with electrical outputs also or you can have the complete manual battery powered ones so this is the dermatome that we commonly use first of all while using this you should make sure that the switch is turned off otherwise you can injure yourself now whenever we use this we are in a sterile environment but the battery that we need to take is usually it comes uh, sister gives it gives it to us from outside so what you need to do is make sure that you press these buttons on either side release this outlet you have with you a socket to help put the battery in you will keep it like this and from outside the sister will just slide in the battery then you leave this and you reattach the hold on the back now when you are holding a dermatome you have to see that this button which will be on the lower side and you have to hold it from the top so if you are right handed it's actually easy to get a good grip on the top and support it from below with the left hand now comes the part for inserting the blade you'll have these two hooks on either side which you need to release so just lift them up once you lift them up this flap will automatically open it'll come down like a draw bridge then you take the blade remember these are all very sharp and you always should have your gloves on while putting them so now you take the blade the sharp edge will face that side and you have three points here where you need to fix them in it'll have a perfect fit and sit in nicely then you put these flap you put this flap back in and you fix it now once you've fixed it then you again need to adjust the thickness of the graft you want which can be seen from this side you have markings from 1 to 10 again at 1 mm each you have to pull this knob and you can take it to and fro to adjust it we usually keep it at 3 or 4 now over here you have a lot of slots and depending on the length of the graft you want to take so if i want to take a full length all the slots need to be down if you want a shorter one you can just raise them up and you can get a shorter graft in that case so once it's ready to go then you finally turn the switch on from here you hold it get a good grip and then you press the button from below while taking a graft again position it at 45 degrees angle and as you go you keep on sliding it and the graft will come which you can see on this surface and you can see the thickness that you're getting once it's off just give a swift upward movement the graft will cut on its own and you can remove it that's all about the dermatome